the energy vibration um, reading for the Opsifiti Mensen and it is um, the 11th week of the year 2018 and the week begin from the 12th until the 18th and it's the week of duality it's this um, all this what convert in days away come a three year um, Kai art up it is awake from the looked energies and water and you can in deze week well good omgaan omdat jullie draag ook the energy of an looked and that from hair and water okay so it's a week from the hair and the energy of water but um, you guys can really um, deal with this week because you have you work with all four energies okay so let's see what's happening for you guys on Monday you have the energy of the strength and this is good because this is a positive energy um, it's the energy of fire um, you guys are now or have the energy of fire so you are going to be okay on Monday on Tuesday you have the energy of the, the uh, king of water um, you are going to have to be dealing with someone who is uh, um, you're going to be dealing with someone who is a Pisces a cancer or a scorpion and then you have the energy of temperance okay um, this energy of temperance um, this person could be someone who is that you're having an, um, an um, intimate relationship with and um, someone who is not working on the high energy vibration someone who is all about sex that sort of a thing and you have the king of hair so this is a situation because you guys have the energy of the kings coming in you have strength and the energy of the devil so what is going on here you have to be careful because um, you both carry the energies of these people so you can be aware of what is going to come up you have the nine of Pentacles this is wonderful you are going to be having as a, a, um, a wonderful strong financial stability um, you're going to be hearing about it so um, the energy of strength and the nine of Pentacles and you have a situation to do with with a king of water in the weekend oh, you have um, another king comes up which is the king of fire so um, this is a week of duality I did say it and the energy of the world so it, this is good for you absolutely that the energy of the world comes up okay three of swords a loss let's see what is the loss what is the loss that is coming up okay it's duality and you guys have so this is a powerful week for you guys it's going to be a week of a lot of having inner strength because um, you guys are working with the king of water you're working with the king of fire and you're working with the king of hair this can be and it's going to affect each and every one of you so um, for each and every one of you um, remember you are one of the most bizarre you you are the most the strongest sign of the zodiac because you carry all four element and you can work with all four element so the aspect of this ladies and gentlemen everyone the aspect of this is that some of you are going to have inner strength with the energy of the nine of pentacles and the king of water um, nine of pentacles and the king of water okay we are going to look at the situation because there seems to be our break coming in whatever the situation is the strength the king of pentacles what is happening a new beginning a new start so some of you are going to be having a new start in a strength a new start with the king of pentacles this is good news this is news about work that is coming up for some people um, and uh, this could be a promotion but this is news about work that is coming up for people and a new start okay whatever the situation was let's say that some of you had a relationship with the king of water and then something transpire what is happening now is that you're going to find inner strength and you are going to have a new start with this person the king of water and temptation the energy of the devil 
um, it's about sex um, whatever um, this king has taken from you is going to be returned so let's say that this king took something from you this king came in your life and took something from you it's going to be returned okay the devil and the king of swords a new beginning a new start a new love is going to be coming in for you guys um, so a new love is going to be coming in for you guys and this love could be coming um, a love of you connecting with um, someone because of an intimate relationship or um, it is new love that is coming in this could be um, a temptation um, a love for something that is unbolden love um, um, an unbolden love is always that um, you you're going to find ways and means of um, satisfying your sexual urge this is what I'm getting I'm sorry <laughs> I'm sorry I've never had this before but this is what came out so it's a week of double energies and this is it I have been saying to a lot of people because you guys have these three kings whatever is happening new love is coming and um, this new love is coming from someone at the end of the week who is an um, people who are carrying the energies of an Aquarian a Gemini or a Libra but it's a false it's false okay it is false really false okay let's look and see what is happening at the beginning of the week at the beginning of the week you you need to find inner strength money is coming to you news about money is coming to you and you have the energy of the four of Pentacles so your financial situation is going to be balanced out in this week okay it is a strong foundation it is you trying to hold on to whatever you have and you are receiving a message that um, your financial situation is going to be okay so you know you're coming in on Monday with such as a strength and Tuesday something is going to happen you're going to receive a message and um, this message is going to let you know that your um, financial situation is going to be good okay then um, in the middle of the week let's look and see what is happening um, you have the energy of the seven of swords again um, in reverse so there is an another energy of the six of swords in reverse so um, what this is saying is that you have ended a journey with a situation that was transpiring some of you could end a journey with a, a face a Pisces a cancer or a scorpion or some of you could be ending the journey with an Aries Leo or Sagittarius okay and um, this is going to be good because as we move forward um, to the ending of the week you have the energy of the king of wands and some of you um, have ended this journey and there's a lot of kings coming up and let's see what's happening with the nine of Pentacles and the king of wands nine of Pentacles and the king of wands is that money is going to be coming through for you and justice is going to prevail okay so this is going to be wonderful a happy um, a family situation is going to come out so the heartbreak the heartbreak that you have with a family situation it's going to be okay so some of you have heartbreak with a family situation but it's going to be okay it's going to be ill okay let's look the middle of the week some of you are going to be um, be learning about a loss and whatever um, the lies that was told and that sort of a thing you're going to have a forgiveness about this okay um, you're holding on to whatever you have um, a lot of lies were told and the king there is someone who um, 
uh, it can be um, an Aries, a Leo, or a Sagittarius, uh, to get a work with the king of, of air, to create a situation, and now justice comes in. Justice comes in and bring the situation to an end, and the energy of the world comes out, okay? Um, whatever that has transpired, um, there was an injustice situation. I'm, I'm, I'm looking at the situation, and um, there are so many messages come, coming in, because you guys um, work with the four energies, and because you work with the four energies, a lot of situations are coming in for different people because you guys need to um, look out for a situation that has to deal with the king of hair and the king of wands. The king of hair, um, the king of wands is here twice. So that is in someone who is a Aries Leo or a Sagittarius. He's here twice. And whoever this king of air is it's not really a nice person um, I'm you know I can't I can't see because the devil is beside him with the king of wands so it's like they're trying to create just something to bring as if oh new love is coming in it's gonna be nice it's false love false love false love don't do it false love don't do it. It's false love. Okay, false love. Um, there's a lot of lies, but the lies are coming to light. There is a lot of lies. The lies are coming to light. Whatever has transpired, there's a lot of lies, and the lies are coming to light. What is so beautiful about your? Um, this week is that there is a new beginning new start for people who are looking for new jobs and that sort of a situation um, a new start if you were had a relationship with someone who was um, um, a Pisces cancer or a scorpion there is going to be a new start with you and this person um, you guys are going to end up to be like business partner um, um, for some of you um, if you are with the Queen of Pentacles, this is going to the Queen of Pentacles is going to bring a lot of financial stability in your world. Um, uh, so you have new love is a false love. This new love is really false. Don't do it. There is justice that is going to happen. Say you guys have a conflict with someone who is an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius, there is going to be justice that is coming in, okay? And there's going to be an ending. Um, there's a lot of stuff that is going to be happening, and they're all dualities. Um, the energy of number one is going to be your energy vibration in this week. It's going to be an energy of number one. Justice is here. It is also 11 dualities so um, this is going to be um, not all that glitter is gold and trust me people it's true not all that glitter is gold um, I've seen this a lot of time and that's why I'm always aware of it that um, sometimes people comes up um, and not all that glitter is gold because um, sometimes you are not aware of certain aspects and certain things so but um, this new love that is coming in um, from the the king of hair nope don't do it no it's like it's glitter it's like wow oh nice yeah don't do it uh, it's not mm -mm. no don't do it uh, Please listen to your Sun, Moon, and Rising sign and go back and listen to the monthly reading because this is the third week of March. And um, go back and listen to the monthly reading because there could be messages that haven't come out in this reading that is in the month of March. I'm wishing you a wonderful, wonderful week. Namaste.